Welcome back everyone to episode 28 of the US series and we are still trying to take full control over Somalia. We have about 75% of the region under our full control and we're going to do some air raids on the terrorist camps and while we do that we are also going to increase our national agents to oops 200,000 and we're going to increase our funding for fighting against terrorism that took a large chunk out of our budget but that's okay and real quick, I want to show everyone something. So we produced um, or we built a lot of oil wells in this series. And that does have an effect. So as you can see, in the beginning of the series, it was $82 per barrel of oil. And we, since we oversaturated the market intentionally, um, that brought the price down to $69.50. And we're going to build more oil wells. So that's going to be a topic that I go over in my tutorial that I'm working on so first we're going to go to Nebraska and I'm going to build shale oil wells I'm going to do five in each state So this should help our economy. All right, so we're done with Nebraska. We're gonna go to Iowa, do the same thing. Let's just double check and make sure we don't have It's just one wind farm and two nuclear plants. Let's start around here. I'll do one more. All right, so we're done with Iowa. And the next state is Wisconsin. Let's double check and make sure I don't have any more oil wells in this state. We don't. Let's try it's weak. Oh, that's right. Southeastern. Um okay, there we go.
Okay, so there's two more. Right, so we're done with uh done with the oil wells. So let's go to fuel. Alright, so we are not meeting our demand. So let's go ahead and just invest ten billion. The package has been delivered. The delivery deadlines were met. We are already taking advantage of the equipment. Nice. Unfavorable regime in Poland. Um, let's see. So let's look at our debt. All right, so reduce that of poor countries. Let's go with 50 billion. All right, so start attacking. We're going to violate terrorist camps. Start doing the air raids on them. And let's do a couple missile strikes. Let's move our cannons up here to uh, start some mortar fire also. Uh, let's assist with the uh, missile strikes. Right. Favorable in Georgia. It. All right. Um, let's go to Secret Service real quick. Somali Democratic Movement. Have him under surveillance. Let's go ahead and infiltrate. And actually, let's increase cyber analysts to 70,000. All right, let's send airstrike to that terrorist camp. And actually, let's double check on China. So I have to look back to see uh, what their national deficit was in the beginning. I want to say it was about 8%. And I believe we forced that as well by placing tariffs on different sectors of their economy. Um, even unemployment, I believe we forced that up. And as you can see, we have a 3.66% surplus. Our inflation is down to 2.11. And just under 1% unemployment.
Okay, Russian network finance caliphate terrorists which attack Indonesia. We're not gonna worry about that. Um actually with China Let's go to our industry. Actually, let's subsidize Alzheimer's vaccine. Um, let's go to electronic components. Let's bump this up by another five billion. Um, household appliances. Let's increase that to five billion instead of five hundred million. See if we could do more damage to China's economy by All right, construction of electric vehicles. Let's go to production. All right, so they're still at the very top for electric vehicles. Let's bump this up to 40%. The decree takes effect as of today. All right, so we're kicking out 757,088 legal immigrants. Um... We're going to address the I immigrant situation soon. I think you're doing a soon. good job. The package has been delivered. The package. All right, so our helicopters came in that we ordered. Um, let's go to services. Still trying to grow our economy even more. Um, all right, so in the very beginning, I set that at three billion. I'm going to increase that to six billion now. And numerical networks. Let's do the same for them. I have proof Russian government secretly financed a Somali which attacked the United States. Okay, so now we're gonna, gonna deal with them. Um Let's see, what do they... Do they produce a lot of... Um, we'll have to figure that out, but... Let's go to our agents there. So we only have 75 agents. Let's pull we're gonna pull four hundred agents out of Libya. So we accomplish what we needed to there. And we're gonna put four hundred agents in Russia.
And we're also going to try to dismantle terrorist groups in that country. Our infiltrated agents had the chance to carry out a sabotage operation. A sort of Bulgarian opening, if you'll allow me the analogy, that according to... All right, so let's take a look at the inflation. Still at 211. Let's drop that by 50 basis points. All right, environment. Let's do this. Let's do another 40,000 or both. I should keep the green energy nuts happy. Good morning. I didn't come empty handed. All right, let's see what they want. Um, production 35. So they want to purchase a satellite. I'll agree to that. And let's go ahead and end that meeting. All right, so let's go to finance and see how our economy is growing. As you can see, that's going up. All right, so 0.76 unemployment. That's really too strong, but I'm not going to uh, discourage that. I'll just let it play out and see what happens. Um, let's deal with some issues with immigration. So we're going to modify economic quotas. I'm going to drop this down to 166. All right, so that was 100% approval. I will call that the Immigration Reform Act of 2027. All right, let's put this on pause. All right, so naturalization. All right, so this is for immigrants coming in the right way. So can we do softer on that? Nope, they're not going to go for it. But they want more rigid conditions. Uh, we're not going to do that. We're going to keep that at medium. But regular... 
station. So what's the support for that? 83. No real indifference from the public. The public is starting to get tired of it. Um... Right, so let's do more tightly controlled. All right, Bolivia, tightly controlled. All right, Chile. Um, Colombia, we're going to... Okay, Costa Rica. Cuba, all right, that's already. All right, so that's done already. Okay, I know we're gonna tighten that up some. Um, I'm going to tighten that up. So we're basically doing all the countries in South America and, and Central America. So we're pretty much done with that. Ah, Venezuela, that's the main country. All right, so we're done with that. Um, no, we're still not accepting refugees. Don't recognize that. Right. Family unification will keep that as is. All right, so let's go to construction. Still do another 1,000 um, detention centers. And let's go to crime. No, actually, let's go to justice. So, let's do 1,000 more prisons. Because we want that, um, 
want the crime rate to go down further. Determine severity of punishments. Let's go with 30 years. So we'll pass that. That's... Oh, well, that's one of the advantages to having an all Republican House of Representatives and Senate. There's only one Democrat in the Senate. Age of sexual consent, we'll leave that. We're not doing a social credit score. All right, let's see this. Let's see. I'll leave that alone. One of my men succeeded in infiltrating Key Center. According to my calculations, the information all gained, in geopolitical terms, our agents had to abort. Our agents had to abort. Alright, simply finances. Skinny, okay. We'll just hold on to that information. The package has been delivered. Our armaments industry has worked well and delivered on time. All right, let's look at, all right, so our quarterly surplus is around 400 billion. And we're going to increase some taxes here. Industrial pollution. Do that. Pump that up to 60. And... Let's see how they feel. Nope. So, I'll leave that alone then. Uh, gambling. Nope, they're not having that either, so we'll leave it alone. Everything has been implemented in the country to prepare for the national holiday that will take place in two weeks. It is obvious that your presence is essential. Good, we're in agreement. I shall look forward to your attendance. All right, let's get a little more uh, aggressive with immigration. So let's do another. Let's do another massive deportation. Tension. Oh, forest fire in Ohio. All right. Let's do eight billion. One of our drones has detected camouflaged enemy units that we have listed on our military map. We 
the bill has been voted on and the law has been passed. All right, so we have more severe punishments for, for crimes being committed. So instead of 16 years, they're going to get 30. So that should help our crime rate go down. The population affected by the disaster is in a very precarious situation. Must have lost a lot and even everything and are asking the state for help to survive. Right, let's just do another two billion. It's true that the blow cannot really be described as fatal. Two arrests. All right. Okay, let's do some mortar fire on that base. Let's do an air We are going strike. to violate. All right, so we're more favorable. The funeral will take place next week. Spring the ships closer to the surface. The vote was held and the reform was adopted. You have to strike while the iron is hot. All right. Let's real quick take a look at fuel. Still hasn't really gone up any. This loss is so very painful to us all. Dear in our memories, these loved ones will always remain. Each and every one of these families have my entire support in this difficult moment. Toughening. All right, so they're starting to get annoyed with me for my policy on immigration. All right, so number of immigrants dropped a little bit. All right, let's do some housing. Let's just do 20,000 new homes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Ignition. Um, let's see. Fossil wall electricity production. Right, so three hundred and sixty five billion. Right. 
So we have 395 in our treasury. So let's pay a couple of these guys off. Okay, that's one trillion. So that's paid off. That's paid off. Let's pay off Switzerland. Alright, so the rest we'll keep for ourselves. One of our drones has detected camouflaged enemy units that we have listed on our military map. The bill has been voted on and the law has been passed. The bill has been voted on and the law has been passed. The terrorist organization has nodded off. Our infiltrated scientific agents inform me that they could be in a situation to provoke a major nuclear accident. This target uh, would be their privileged target. We did that enough times already. And Justin Trudeau wants to meet with us. Alright, let's try to continue to maintain our alliance with India, so we're going to send them 5 million. My fellow countrymen and women, on this solemn day, I want to express my pride and affection. Today, while celebrating the history and genius of our beautiful country, I wish to remember what unites us rather than what divides us in order to look into the future with confidence. One of my men succeeded in infiltrating Key Center. According to my calculations, the information or gained, in geopolitical terms, could be close to 2.73 on Saks graphic. Our agent also allows us to anti- Alright, so we'll go through with that. Um, let's see how our immigration is working. Still trying to flatline. And let's take a look at all right, so let's just go ahead. No, actually, not going to. I'm going to save that money. Not sure why they're protesting. Alright, Turkey. Still an ally, so give them five million. Cutter, we don't care about. One of our drones has detected camouflaged enemy units that we have listed on our military map. We right. All right, so I think I'm going to end this episode and...
people don't like that the war is still going on. But thanks again. Thanks for supporting this channel. And I will see you soon.